Hello and welcome back to another video. It's me, Bryn. So today I'm on an overnight backpacking ride to my grandparents' house in Bristol. Should be fun, mainly to test this piece of kit. It's the Tailfin Aero Pack. Looked great so far, easy to fit. So we're gonna have a look at that. But first of all, I'm back, yeah. So I recently competed in GB Duro, finished third. That was mega, my first real experience of ultra racing. So we're gonna be doing a lot more of that over the next year and hopefully documenting that. Picking up some more results maybe, having a lot of fun definitely. So I thought I'd bring you along with the ride. But as I said today, going to Bristol, it's gonna be roughly 100 miles. Need to drop some stuff off on the way. Perfect day to test out the Aeropat. Let's go. So before we get into the ride, I just want to give a quick overview of the tail fin. Here it is. This is the carbon aero pack, which means you've got carbon um, mount here. The bottom of the bag is then rigid, and then it mounts the frame. Super easy to set up. Brilliant setup so far. The bag is huge, so it's got all the stuff I need. And like I said, just fastens in super quick. It's got quick release dropouts just down here. Whip it off, whip it on. Brilliant bit of kit so far. First ride, can't wait to get going. So Tailfin are based in Bristol, um, coincidentally where I'm riding today. And they were kind enough to send me this out to test, so I can't wait to get ready into that. And yeah, without a doubt, without a doubt, without further ado, let's get into the ride. Here I am, Neath Canal. Wait. Neath Canal. Um, gotta say, I'm only half an hour in, but this tail fin is mega. Um, the sway or lack of is insane. Like, I've only ever used like a conventional bag. So, you know, with straps and buckles, just clipping it on. This thing pff, blows it out of the park, to be honest. Get out of the saddle, you don't even know the tail fin's there. Um, it's stiff and rigid, like, it's so quick. Um, Love it so far. I'll keep updating you, but yeah. What can I say? It's brilliant. We're on the Neath Canal though, so yeah. The squeaky brake, never great. So, I'm just over an hour in, 35Ks, headwind, block, headwind. Probably for the whole way. Uh, yeah. Ah oh, well. Let's get cracking. Just gone past Margan Park. Uh, recently raced the Welsh uh, cross country mountain bike champs there. Onwards and hopefully less windy. Well, there we go. Made it to the Grant's house. Chilling in bed. Um, phone decided just it wasn't going to work today. So that died a few hours before the end of the ride. So that's why there's no footage. Um, bit of a pain, but I'll get some more tomorrow. As you can see over there, tail fin, just whipped it off. Quick release, mega. It's on the floor, I'm in bed, and now, gonna go to sleep probably. It was 5 hours 40 today, hundred just under 160Ks. Quite nice, standard 5 hour headwind, but yeah, w watch the, the wind will switch tomorrow and we'll have a headwind home. You heard it here first. But tomorrow, I'll get some more footage, and hopefully... Get home in time to go see Wayne Boy in the evening. So yeah, that should be good. Catch you guys in the morning. Well, it's the morning now. Woken up. Not just now, as it may look like. I have been for a nice walk in the woods with the dog. Can have some food. Probably head back about midday. Slightly shorter route today, which should be really nice. 140 k's. Bit more elevation. Just packing up the stuff. Ready to go. Head off then. Make my way home. Hopefully get more footage today. Nice uh, ride, gonna go up through Mirtha, but just skirt around it to avoid it. Just coming out of Lays, lovely, uh, lovely park in Bristol. Just um, about 10 minutes into today's ride. Taking it chill so far, really enjoying. Um, but yeah, making my way home now. I reckon it'll be about just over five hours. Right, well we're on the Severn Bridge now. And as, as I expected, it's a bloody headwind again. 
God damn. But it's an alright day, it's a little chilly, a little bit colder than yesterday. But yeah, just a block, block headwind. Hour in now, I reckon about four to go. Yeah. So I'm just through and out the other side of a place called Usk. And I'm getting really hungry, geez. Super hungry, so I'm gonna have to stop and have some food now, but two hours, just under two hours in, so yeah, and I start quite late, so it is lunchtime. And damn, I'm hungry, geez. Whew, well then. It's been a while since I picked the camera up. A long while, actually. We're within the last 15 Ks now. I'm very thankful because I'm not gonna lie, I haven't enjoyed probably the past three hours. The roads have just sucked and it's just time has just literally slowed down so much. But yeah, bruh, it is pretty damn tedious and yeah, pretty grey as well. But yeah, there was a long period where everything was just grey. The road, the houses, the sky, everything. And I just cracked really hard mentally. Uh, I kind of just, yeah, I was kind of ready for it to be done. And it really is, so whoop whoop, never have to do this again. Thank you. Bang on six o'clock, and I'm just rolling into the house. 140 k's on the clock, just under five hours, 20 minutes. And yeah, I'm glad that's over. Very, very glad. It is done.